Thank you, Haley. Riverside County is close to finalizing a new ordinance defining what types of activities can take place at ranches in the East Valley. News Channel 3's Jennifer Franco shares what the changes would mean for local business owners and surrounding communities. So here we usually have the DJ going that direction to keep the noise in control. Claudia Lua Alvarado owns Rancho 51 and Day Garden in Coachella. She and her team are getting the space ready for a wedding this weekend. It's the type of event that doesn't quite fit into the framework of Riverside County's existing noise ordinance. I think it's obviously time overdue. Uh, unfortunately, we went through a process of a couple of years. Last April, the Board of Supervisors agreed to start making changes to the county's noise ordinance. The goal is to strike a balance between ranches that host big events with live music and the residents that live in the area. Now it's going to be close to four years working on this. Um, instead of having the planning department create a uh, ordinance, we, are, we have been working with them. The county and some ranch owners have also been working to create an ordinance to define how they can operate when hosting events. A draft was presented at a community meeting last Friday. The requirements are going to be that you have to have um, a farm. Um, it can be 20% or 40% of date palms or it can be 20% of date palms and then another farm that you would like to have. Permitted ranch owners will also have to meet other requirements, like getting inspected by the fire and health departments. The permits will apply to the land forever and the cost is still under discussion. By August, we should all be in the process of getting permitted or finalizing permitting. Okay. In Coachella, Jennifer Franco, News Channel 3.